Hello and welcome into the Born Braves mid-game interview. I'm Troy Lynch and today who joins me is not a player, not a Born Braves coach, but head coach of Melissa High School, Joe Williams. Joe, thank you so much for joining us today. And the reason why we bring Joe to, into this interview is because he was Camden Dusnak's head coach in high school, so he knows every little thing. Now, Melissa High School is not even close to the Cape. It's actually in Texas. So did you drive up here or did you fly? No, we flew in on Sunday, um, found out last year that Cam was going to play in the Cape Cod League and my wife and I made a decision we had to come down here and watch him. Just a great atmosphere. Now, how did you find out that he was going to be playing in the Cape Cod League? Well, actually last year we came down here for a vacation and everybody talks about the Cape and uh, said you got to go watch a game. So we did that, it was just my wife and I last year and then uh, I sent Doozy some pictures and I said it would be cool if you could play down here. And about a couple weeks later he told me, Coach, I got an invite to play in the Cape Cod League, which is awesome. Uh, that's great. I love that story every single time. Now, is it fun to see Camden? Are you only here for this today, or are you going to be here uh, for other games too? Yeah, we're going to be here until Friday, and hopefully if the weather holds off, we'll get to see him play a couple more times. And, you know, if you're a baseball fan, you're you're a fan of Camden Dusnak, so anytime you can watch him play, you take advantage of it. Well, any Camden Dusnak fan knows that he is an absolute hustle player. We see him diving all the time in BP, hustles to everything. Was he the exact same way in high school? Absolutely. From sixth grade PE, any game you played, he was going to be the little hustler out there, and then that continued to his first practice as a freshman in high school until his last practice as a senior in high school. Now we saw him hit a home run ju just a few weeks ago. Nobody really expected that kind of power because this is his first year in the Cape. Was he a home run hitter back in high school? You know, his, his freshman year, he didn't he didn't have a home run. He had some doubles, and I think he had six triples, and then uh, the last three years actually hit 26 combined. So uh, he's deceiving. He's extremely strong for his size, and uh, his bat speed's always been quick. So uh, when he gets a hold of it, the ball takes off. Now it's really funny because our photographer, Steph Cravello, she always takes pictures of Camden Dusnak, and he always ends up in the air somehow. We've given him the name Superman. Do you think this is an appropriate nickname? For sure, for sure. I mean, when you see him in practice, the way he plays, he does the same exact thing in practice. So when you see the plays he makes in the game, you're just used to it. So, uh, you know, you just appreciate his effort, especially as a fan and, and for sure as a coach. Now, I know you've only seen one game of him so far, but are, are you impressed of what he's done? Absolutely. Doozy probably tell you he's a little disappointed in his performance, but, you know, like I said, his effort's never in question. So, uh, and he got the W, so he's going to be happy. Um, it's just good to see him play again. Now, if you had any advice to give Camden right now as a coach, what would you give him? Have fun. He's earned it. He's in the Cape Cod League. It's awesome. All right, last question. Where do you see Camden Dusnak in the next 10 years? Uh, I think you're going to see him in Major League Ballpark. You know, you never doubt the kid. Uh, he's always been an overachiever, and uh, the first two years at DBU kind of shows you that he can play with the elite. And um, there's no doubt in my mind he's going to play at the next level because that's what he wants to do. And when he wants something, he's going to go get it. Well, Coach, thank you so much for joining us here on the Bourne Braves mid-game interview. I'm Troy Lynch. He's Joe Williams, and we'll see you in the next game. Beautiful. Thank, thank you, you so much, Coach. That was I great. Appreciate it. No problem. And makes the catch for the final out of the ball game. Ball game over. Bravos win. Fastball off the outside corner. Gets away from the catcher, Logan Ice. Here comes Garcillo. He scores the winning run. The Braves take it 4-3 on a wild.